<laughs> oh, she bless you. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> Welcome to Stupid Movies, episode 128. Where we watch them so you don't have to. Yes. And this week we watched... Pledges, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, You're showing them the back of the box. Yeah, well, okay. There we go. <laughs> 2018, not rated, 77 minutes long. Yeah, yeah. Directed that by... DJ Red. DJ Red. Which I feel like he did all the hip-hop music in this movie. I kind of don't think that's his real name. Probably not. Starring... Nobody. <laughs> Arthur Davis, Ren Harris... And Tim Dreyer, which, which never heard of any of them. So what was this movie about, Rob? Uh, you want me to do it? Uh, well, it, um, so, uh, <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, basically, so <laughs> college kids who are pledging for a frat and sorority, whatever. But then there was a girl and a guy in the band who kidnapped him. I don't know what they were. It's like, anyway, so they get dropped off in the woods. Uh-huh. And, uh. I like the setup. Yeah. Stuff started happening. So what did you like, Adam? Um, yeah. Uh, the the uh the 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 you pulled me. Oh, I'd rather not pull you. I like the score. One thing we can both agree on was the gore. The gore effects, the makeup was pretty good. The the ones that were practical, not CGI, were really good. Right, CGI was bad. It was really bad. It was bad. But yeah, there's some practical that for the low budget. What? Hold on. The gore mm. for the low budget. The <laughs> right. gore was good. It looked good. What my friend Rob is trying to say is, <laughs> there, we were impressed with the gore for the budget they had. Right, yeah. and the quality of it. I mean, yeah, you know, it was shot well. You, you know, I liked that the killer was super vague. Oh yeah. We were down to like five minutes left in the movie, and we were still kind of like oh, trying to figure out what, what the hell is the killer. Is it a slasher? Is it a monster? Is it supernatural? supernatural. Is it yeah. alien? <laughs> it, it was not at all predictable. Um. Um, yeah, it wasn't predictable. Yeah. Well, yeah. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> I just like to well, agree. Welcome to the Super Movie <laughs> Show. <laughs> I like the setting and the atmosphere. The setting was really good. I, it was I, cool I, out in the woods. I like wooded movies. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> wooded movies? <laughs> yeah, I think maybe we like that more than most people because we live in a very flat non wooded state. That's true. Like where there are woods, they're like twenty feet wide. There's not a lot there. <laughs> right. So we kinda did that. Yeah. It's like we don't get to see this. It's like people from the coast who like children of the corn and we're like, fuck it's corn. Why are you afraid of corn? And they're kids. Corn's everywhere. Yeah, there's corn everywhere. There's, there's kids there's everywhere. Kids everywhere. <laughs> exactly. You know what? I like the alien monster thing. Mandingo whatever it was. Mandy, was he big Porn star? Yeah, no. I, I'm pretty sure that the monster in this might have been a big porn star. I don't know. It, yeah. It, 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 what, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> what little bit they showed of it, I yeah. liked. I mean, it took forever to see. It, was that even what was killing him? I don't know. That's We still don't really know, but I, I like that. Yeah. The acting was yeah, decent. You know, not, not, they acted. You, you know my favorite part of this movie? Everybody died. Everybody. Mine too. Not I've... a single person survived. Fuck you all. They're all dead. Spoiler! But no one's gonna go watch this. No, no one's gonna watch this. No, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> For those of you who are, hi, uh, thank you. We like you. Hello, all seven um, of our fans. <laughs> <laughs> I, I thought there would be a final girl, and I was wrong. There was no final girl. So I like to be proven wrong. Um, <laughs> and everybody was attractive. They were all very attractive. Men and women, and the yeah. monster, and everyone was good looking. You would bend the monster over and ream it from behind. Yeah, I would totally go Predator on the monster. Predator. And, and not like the Arnold Schwarzenegger Predator, but like the Chris Hansen Predator. <laughs> what do we not Goodbye. <laughs> Adam, if you can't tell, was mad that there was no actual news. I was very angry. They're, they fucking teased it, and teased it, and they were like, oh, 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 no! Fuck you. Yeah. Too many teases. Um, and you know what? I would extend that to uh, a lot of the kills, too. Right. There was Lord a lot of teasing. They yeah. were like, oh, 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 no. No. Yeah, there was a lot they could have done. Um, even though we liked that it was vague with, you know, what was happening and who was killing him or what was killing him. Some of it, the, mm, it's just too much. Too yeah. vague. And it's like it, it set up things up and they just went poof. Yeah, there were like three different this could be it sort of things. Because they got, okay, they were at a government facility. 
So maybe they're mutants. Right. There was like all that weird shit out in the forest and the weird writing on the van. Maybe they're ghosts. Right. There was shit flying around in the sky. Right. Maybe they're aliens. So they set these all three of these up and didn't go anywhere with any of them. Right. And that's it, kind of obnoxious. Yeah, and they even you made you think at the beginning of Slasher because it was from a point of view right. that kind of dun, dun, dun. could have been a slasher. That's a slasher trope. And yeah. it, it just it oh, sorry. Uh, it didn't go anywhere with any no. of them, and that was really obnoxious because <clears> it would have been cool for if they just picked one, just one thing to like, and been them. like, "We're gonna do a ghost story. Right. We're gonna do an alien story. Whatever it is, yeah. But pick one and fucking do it. Yeah. So that's kind of you know it's kind of cool, but it's not at the same time. Yeah. And, and same, it annoyed me. Yeah. And same with the pacing. Kind of the same thing. It was only 70 minutes. Uh, um, 77 minutes. Thank you. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> you know, which is, I thought, a perfect time for this movie. Any Too much more, I think it would have... Uh, been too long. Too long. Yeah. Um, but at the same time, they could have... They, they um, would have done more. Oh, oh hey, Bioslime was delayed. Hey, so, the, but the, the movie kind of went by fast, but there wasn't a whole but lot But the scenes on. went by slow. And it, there was no payoff. No. To any of this. No. And that's what... It just ended. That's what gets me angry more than anything. Yeah. There there was... They did all of this setup, and they were like, oh, you know, really attractive looking people in their underwear. No nudity. Right. Really cool monster. It Not going to tell there. you anything about yeah, it. It, it just, just stands there. It just shows up. Two creepy little ghost girls. Up there for one scene, and they're gone. The whole movie is just college kids against a spooky soundtrack. Yeah. Because there was so much of nothing happening, but it would be like... And you were like, oh yeah, something's gonna happen. And then it didn't have anything. It was just a musical cue, and that was it. Right, right. I liked it. Look at my neck fab. Look at that. I need to grow a beard. So, I don't know. Overall, it's very middle of the pack for me. I didn't hate it, I didn't love it. But, you know, if I'll ever watch it again, I don't know. I did buy it. It was just okay. Uh, could have been better, could have been worse. I'll give it a four out of eight. Had there been a few minor differences, this movie would have been middle of the road for me. If they'd picked a single single reason for the killer, or a single type of killer, would have been a middle right. of the road. There had been some boobs. Would have been middle of the road. Sorry, had the acting sorry. been bad, it would have been middle of the road. Because then I could have had fun and made fun of the actors. Right. But they were okay. They weren't great. You know, but they were okay. It just was missing enough elements to not quite be adequate. So I'm going to give it a two and a half out of eight. Oh, two and a half. I dropped my score. Dropped it a little bit. Yeah. Fair enough. Yep. So, you know, if you want to check it out, go check it out. If you don't, don't. you're not missing anything. You don't want to, trust me. <laughs> you know what pisses me off more than anything? What's that? I've spent months trying to find this movie. Because I heard about it and I saw it wasn't this cover. It was the alternate cover, which we're going to insert here. I spent months trying to find it just because of that cover. Right. And now I finally found it. I'm disappointed as shit. So, yeah, you know, it is what it is. Fuck it. Fuck it. Don't watch this movie. <laughs> Head over to Facebook.com slash Stupid Movies. Or check us out on Instagram at Stupid Movies, at The Horror Punk, at Dr. Sketch Turner. Be our Not friends. Be our friends. We don't have, we have each other and really that's about it. Yeah. We need friends. <laughs> <laughs> For just one dollar a day, you too can sponsor a stupid movie. <laughs> Bloop. See ya. Bloop. Bloop. <laughs> <laughs>